Hey guys, I'm over here at 110 Hobby looking over the TRX-6. And yes, this is a box that has a sticker on the TRX-4. Uh, there's a brand new one on there. We're about to do a draw for this. So it's kind of cool. But let's quickly go over their demo unit, which is uh, this one. And uh, it's a sweet little truck. And this one has a even special, it's got the 110 Hobby, the little sticker on top of it. <clears throat> so what is really neat with this is it does have locking rear diff and everything comes with it. So you have the servos here, just like normal, that they would lock up. And everything for the two locking wheels is on the same servo. So when you actually lock the rear wheel, it actually locks both of them at the same time. You cannot lock the independent, uh, independently lock this one and independently lock that one. You do lock up the both rear or the front. So it's just like the regular TRX-4, which is fully loaded with all the servos. And this one does have the two-speed transmission also. And this one it has the stock electronic and looks like it's been holding up. I know a lot of people have been having a lot of issues with their electronic. That's one of the first thing they actually change on this truck is the electronic. But this thing is pretty, it's, it's heavy. It's a heavy enough truck. It's even heavier with the body. The body is not bad. It's, it's, it's a Lexan. It does come with, it uh, does have the, does it come with a light kit? Yep. So it does come with the light kit. <clears throat> And uh, it's it's a nice body. It's it's well made, and it actually has the nice chrome roll bars at the back, so it gives it a nice finish for the truck. That's for sure. To me, Canadian, that's a truck that's uh, well over eight hundred dollars. So it's to me that's an expensive truck. But for all the options that comes with this truck, it's nice. And keep in mind, you do not get the sound module with it. That's a little extra that they threw in there. So that bumper with the kind of radiator in front, that's stock? No. No, that's extra also? That comes from who? I made it. Oh, you made that. That's kind of <laughs> yeah. cool. So that actually fits on there. And it goes in the front. So that's makes it really neat. That's a nice option. You should start selling that. Heat sink. So they're <laughs> just a bunch of heat sinks. Yeah. Oh, that's that's really cool. Inlaid uh, light bar inside it as well. So you put a light bar in there? You betcha. Huh. Oh yeah, I see it. That's kind of cool. Have extra lights, right? Yeah. <coughs> so the TRX six is is a pretty nice rig. It it is heavy, so it is gonna stay on the trail very good. So it should uh, be very capable on the tr on the trail and the whole chassis and everything and especially with all the axle and all the stuff i think this guy is going to perform better than the trx4 because of the weight that's actually on the bottom so overall that's a pretty nice truck cool well guys if you want to know anything about it leave a comment and <laughs> Thank you.